hey y'all welcome into the channel i hope everybody's having a good day let's go ahead and get some general energy for this reading show me clearly spirit give me an overall energy for this reading viewers welcome in to the channel if you're new and welcome back if you are returning all right thank you each and every one of you guys for your love and your support let's go ahead and get into it i feel things changing for you okay let's try this again because that was way too many cards i just need one spirit for the overall energy of this reading thank you okay perspective all right angel number 39 that's a 12. So it looks like you're in alignment with some sort of perspective or some 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 view. Um, or someone feels like they're in alignment or perspective with you. It says a calm and clear mind is free to see differently. I feel like now that you've completed something, um, be on the lookout. Because Source is about to start revealing the next steps, the next uh, uh, points of interest, okay, for you to take, all right? Um, the next points of evolution, okay? Okay. Um, Someone, you could be needing to adjust something that was misaligned, okay? Maybe that's the need for the three energy, need for you to realign, um, because you could have been connected with something or someone that was not aligned or something like that. All beings of the greatest, highest white light, most high holy angels, thank you, Holy Spirit, for clear and precise messages. Yes. Okay, we have awareness and we have solitude, okay? So someone, um, things that could, uh, sorry, some things that could be significant that could be resonating with you at this time. You could have recently been shopping. Um, you could have recently been shopping for panties or for candles. Someone's candles could have got blown out. Um, you could have been watching Alien vs. Predator. Uh, there could be something significant about a van. Also, palm trees. Okay, um, I think that's it. Oh, Miami could be significant. Um, become, oh, okay, I get it. I get it, I get it, I get it. I forgot what I was doing with this reading, but now I'm back. I'm back, y'all, I'm back. So this is about you giving gratitude for this, this change in perspective or this view. Something about your view you need to give thanks for. Because you, you're very alert, aware, okay present i feel here and now energy but i feel like an alert energy i feel the energy of judgment okay as well but you're in solitude and then there's communication going on around you okay slow and steady wins the race I need to see what this card says because I'm drawn to something in this. Oh, sensitize. So there could be a need for you to sensitize. Be more gentle. Maybe you're paying more attention to yourself. You may need to do your hair, get your hair done. You could be um, desiring... Someone's taking some pictures. Maybe you're getting prepared to take some type of pictures. These could be, maybe this is your birthday picture. This could be an engagement photo. Um, this could be uh, maternity shoe energy, okay? I feel like you're really enjoying your own self. You're enjoying your own energy. In enjoying your own energy, there's like improvements to your beauty being made. Improvements to your appearance. Like she's going from her hair is long and curly and flowy still. Maybe untamed and more tamed here. And then she's got this flower in her hair, which is a dang starfish. That's interesting. There's a sunflower here, which represents God's love. Okay, I feel like listen out for for messages from above you're in this alone time because source is going to be communicating with you source is going to be beautifying your communication beautifying your view beautifying i feel like all of your clairs all of them there's beautification activation increase you need to give thanks let's see awareness here 
there could have been a lot of pain or heartache surrounding you, uh, a lot of conflict or competitiveness uh, revolving around you, okay? I feel the energy of um, disappointment, like someone's disappointed because of what you've been able to accomplish or achieve. But what you've been able to accomplish or achieve is becoming whole in your own existence without the help of anyone or anybody. Nobody, buddy. Nobody, buddy. Nobody, buddy. Okay? The spiritual battles, you fought them by yourself. And you've overcome. Queen of, Queen of Swords energy, I feel. Okay? God has made you a vessel for his kingdom now. Okay? This is what you're going to be finding out. It's like you've been seeing this on Astro, but something is about to come to this reality. Something's coming forward. Four of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, something's coming forward. That's why it was a necessity for you to hold back your energy. Because something's coming forward. Knight of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles. So continue to hold back. Okay. You could just feel like being reserved. More reserved, I feel. Okay. You could have had some reservations about something. Maybe you're you're making reservations. Queen of Cups. Seven of Wands, the Hermit. Yeah. By you um, holding back your energy, you're going to be empowered because they're, they're giving you something. They're offering you the ancestors, source, they're offering you something. So there's a need for your mind to remain calm and clear at this time. Free. Free. So that source can fill you up more of what, what he intends for you to have. We have three of swords showing up. The Hermit, Seven of Wands. If you go in the Hermit energy right now, you pull your energy back. You be mindful. This is mindful energy pulled back here. This is you mindfully pulling your energy back. This is you discerning what you watch, who you participate, who you're around, who you let be in your energy, who you give to, who you let to give, who you allow to give to you. This is an energy of... Um, you harvesting your own energy so that others cannot because God is using you so you've learned that your power also is in controlling how you respond to negativity okay with the three of swords because it's going to come but it all depends on with the six of pentacles excuse me with the six of pentacles okay how you give to it what you give to it do you allow it to overtake you Okay, with the Page of Cups, the Empress card, or do you hold on to your power? Do you hold back when you need to hold back? Are you listening to your intuition enough to know when it's time to do that? And are you obedient when you're asked? There's a level of discipline, okay, with the Four of Swords, all right? There's a need for you to, um, give me the words not go down any 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 holes don't follow anybody any down any damn holes right now it ain't the time for that okay what card am i looking for hold on one second hold on y'all i'm trying to find the meaning of this card right quick based off of this deck because it talked about not going down any holes and this is for your own good it's like for your own protection mind your own business do lock do not look in holes plan for the unexpected and do not believe what others are trying to sell you okay i feel like that is that's it because right now you are being made a vessel for God's kingdom so that's the beauty that you're being filled up with that's what they're about to give you Empress energy a vessel for God's kingdom you someone here is going to be having a spiritual baby 
This baby could be a Virgo. So Source also told me that a lot of people envy you with the Three of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles. This is envy. They envy you because of your position or your title. Your abundance. Empress energy. Page of Cups. But your birthright, it's already been solidified. Okay? Your birthright, your abundance, it's already been solidified. I think that's the reason why you need to be giving this thanks. Okay? Give thanks because these decisions, they've already been made on your behalf. Healing. Miracles. Because of your ability to discern and manifest and not lose hope, not lose faith in your manifestation and what it is you were trying to bring in for yourself. So, I feel like Source is going to be telling you to be thankful for this seat. Thankful for this perspective. Okay? Alrighty. Alrighty. I feel like I need to pull one more card for you. Let's do a Divine Abundance. And then this is going to be the end of your reading and the completion of this series. Yay! So, Signs and Freedom. Freedom signs. Expansiveness. Know that you are free to expand on your energy at this time. It's safe. You are protected. Okay. Uh, we have surrender. Okay. They're saying surrender. I feel like surrender to God's plan. All right. This has been your reading. Yeah. Look. Trust. I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, be sure to like, share, comment, or subscribe. We'll see you next time. Bye.